the 5D family. And we're diving into this and we're really focused on it. And then your vibration changes. You can see it, what is happening. If you pay attention, you're not the same person you were a week ago. Something's shifted. And the more you dive into it, the more it changes, the more it becomes calmer, more centered, more clear, and your vibration starts to rise to a higher frequency. Means that we're entering, we're creating and opening, leveling the ground, creating the environment we have created this bubble, this environment for growth, spiritual growth, to raise your vibrations to fifth dimensional consciousness. Entering into fifth dimension by investing in yourself. You're investing in yourself right now. You have things to do, but you show up every day. And you're attentive. So you're investing in yourself to raise your vibrations to a higher frequency to enter into fifth dimension. But that requires work. And a part of it is to become aware that we need to uncondition ourselves and free ourselves from this golden prison and become the master of the mind rather than to be the slave of it. And for that, sometimes you need a, excuse me, for that, sometimes you need a witch doctor. Sometimes you need the witch doctor. It's just like being ill. And what do we do? We go to our physician, doctor, healer, nutritionist, whatever. But you go to someone who specializes in helping you heal yourself. So in this work, we're doing this work. Sometimes you need the witch doctor to get over the hump. It's okay. You go to someone, assist them, something, because everything else has failed you. Nothing else worked. Then you go say, okay, this dude, this guy, this woman, I don't know why I love him and I respect him, but it's there. But I'm going to do what he or she is telling me or sharing with me because something's changing in me. Something's making me calm. Something making me centered. Something is helping me expanding. I feel the presence. I feel love in my heart. And sometimes we need it. So we go in that direction. Which doctor? <laughs> sure. So we're coming to the end of our Day seventh event. Already it's Friday. So we've got Saturday and Sunday. We have two more events. What am I missing, Mr. Amir? Oh, okay, right. Right. Okay, a couple <laughs> those of you who are the first time or 
tuning in to this from all over the world. Um, you're probably, you know, if you just came, came, uh, joined us through our system, uh, the Zoom application, or you're watching this broadcast from Facebook or Instagram or YouTube. Um, there's a couple events. I mean, there's one, two events. Uh, I have a shamanic healing circle that's going to be on um, November 13th. 12. November 12th is going to be the shamanic healing circle. And then on November 13th, I'm having a workshop. It's called Self-Awakening Mastery Workshop. And in that workshop, we're, I'm go, my goal is to give you the tools, the know-how, and specific active meditation of a number of things. A, how to raise our vibrations to a higher frequency to dive into inner silence. And in this shift of diving into inner silence, you're opening the gateways to the love. So you're inviting the presence, you're inviting God, spirit, the, the love that which is here to emanate itself continuously and in that clarity comes and also specific training of how to master our mind how to come to this place of not being a victim of the mind and its emotions and its tantrum because and the proof is in the pudding. All you want to do is pay attention. Somebody will tell you something you don't like to hear. Your, your kid, your partner, your mom, your dad at work. And look how emotional you get about it. And how reactive you become about it. Whether they insulted your prejudice. They insulted your practice or they disagreeing with something, your football team, your basketball team, your soccer team, whatever it is, and you get bent out of shape, or fear, worry, anxiety, depression is haunting you, all these emotions, and you you can check yourself out, and if you're there, and you're reactive, you're reacting, you can't control yourself. You don't know how to deal with it. And in the self-awakening mastery, we're going to learn all these things. So we're no longer a victim. We're no longer ruled by our mind. And we can see the mind clearly of the tantrum it throws. And then eventually calming it down and mastering it. So it, you have access to a bigger capacity of your mental psyche availability that you can, con you can use it in the right way. You can direct it in the right way when the time comes. So you're not a victim of it. So we're going to learn these things, which is very important. So that's that. Also, um, I created a program called Life Training Program. That's a one-on-one -on -one private coaching, which the program officially is three months, but it's never three months. It sometimes goes on five months that I'm working with you, giving you specific homeworks. and tailor-made spiritual program for your specific needs so it's not general and if you're interested in this program write to me or contact me and then we make a uh, an appointment and i sit with you and of course everything's being done online and then i find out what what is it that you're dealing with and what is it with what area you can't get over the hump and then 
I make a specific training program for you to overcome that. Thank God so far we had the 100% positive uh, results and it's been amazing. And again, like anything else, this is temporarily. I don't know how long I'm able to offer this program, but it's happening right now. And uh, I had in my mind that I can take six people for this coming season. Um, I only have room for four more people. Two people have already signed up. If you're interested, approach me. Uh, don't postpone it. And uh, we get together, we talk about it, and we sign you up, and we start the program soon. Did I miss anything? I miss, oh yeah, right. Amir tells me, I keep forgetting about this. We're a small venture. Um, these program, a lot of the stuff I offer there for the benefit of humanity, our community, and I try to offer free programs as much as I can to the best of my ability. But we're being supported by, um, by you. And we don't have a sponsor. So if you feel like donating, uh, as some of you very generously have donated lately, I'm very grateful. Um, feel free and make a donation to us so we can continue of producing quality uh, videos, podcasts. We can have a better equipment and we can have more precise broadcasts. So um, if you feel like it, go ahead and do it. Uh, there's a donation button on my website and, and on the first page, homepage, and you can just use that or contact us and we'll help you. If you have any comments, questions, requests, you're welcome to write it to me. My email address is info at zaratustra.tv. The website is zaratustra.tv. All of our pages, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, my podcast is Zaratustra 5D. So go ahead and subscribe and feel free to write to us if you have any comments. Um, communicate with us. Look forward to hearing from you. I send you my love and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Namaste. God bless.